Yeah, video never do justice, eh? Oh, never does, buddy. everyone welcome back to the channel i am back on vancouver island in victoria today and this is my very first time here i'm with dean tinant we've done together that video in langford on the famous jordanian bike park it was epic make sure you check it out and dean told me that squamish has some really cool slab but so does victoria so i'm here to make sure it's true he told me it's gonna be steep gnarly just like i like it it's gonna be a fun one enjoy lap number one heartlands Yeah, that was sick. That gap into the slab, just like I like it. Yeah, Woo that's steep. That's really steep. Yeah, dude, that's cool. Really enjoyed that. Yeah, I really like that. Like just on the brakes, yeah. trying to like really find the traction, using the compression to slow down. Wow, that's a gap. It's beautiful as well. This is a big one you told me about? Yeah, I think we should tuck it. For sure. Dude, that's epic. That was good, eh? Yeah. Sick. Whoa, you didn't lie to me. That's uh, steep and gnarly. Pretty exposed as well. Yeah. And there's more moss on this than I remember too. So this first slab, I'm gonna take as slow and controlled as my brakes and tires will let me. At the bottom there, there's some compressions. The trail takes a right and actually the slab keeps going down, so I'm going to want to keep it in control. Yeah, so it's really important to manage your speed because if you carry too much speed on that corner, I guess the second part is uh, going to get even more spicy. Yeah. We should definitely go and take a, take a look at it. Yeah. Yeah, video never do justice, eh? Oh, never does, buddy. It's way steeper and earlier than it looks. It's... uh. It's quite chunky as well, there's a big compression and the rug doesn't seem to have nearly as much uh, traction as the ones in uh, Squamish. We have a smoother rock here, it's not like the granite you guys have. But uh, yeah, I think it's really gonna be about controlling the, controlling the braking, like making sure you brake as hard as you can. Where you get traction and where you don't have much traction is just really managing the rotation of your tire so you just slow down the wheels but don't lock them. Because if you do lock the wheel, then you lose traction and obviously you lose control. So I'm gonna try to keep those wheels turning, but slow. Okay. Okay, let's do it. Cool. Zin first attempt. Yeah, dude. Woo, that looks gnarly, like. He lost a little bit the front here and it's tough to see on camera but it's pretty green and it's still like pretty wet on the dirt and you are like braking super hard coming to that left under so that makes it very tricky good job though okay first attempt on the a line of Atland. i'm gonna go extremely slow and controlled lots of front brake i drop my heels 
some weight behind the seat very very slow I went as slow as I could <laughs> Nice. Man, that looks so good. You came down that so controlled. Thank you. Yeah, I went as slow as I could for the first attempt. I always do that just to gain maximum knowledge with uh, the terrain, the traction, but uh, I feel confident and I can follow you on it. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Controlled. Okay, first time following Dean on this. So lots of front brake, as you can see, very pressure on my rear brake. Nice dude! That was great! Yeah dude! I still took the inside and you still went outside eh? I like the outside! You see like, for me I find the inside is pretty... It's pretty more consistent grade. Yeah. So I feel like I'm able to manage the, the traction a little bit more. Whereas if you go on the left hand side, there is that off camber rock and you need to kind of hop over it. And while you do that, you kind of have to let go the brakes. Yeah. So you technically carry a little bit more speed, but then you can use the corner to slow down and set you up for the next part. Yeah. So it's always interesting to see how people approach the same section with different style. Yeah. But both work well, so. Cool, man. Sick, dude. Good job, that was sick. Well, we're gonna keep on checking out this trail. Okay, okay let's finish this trail. Woo. I have no idea what's coming and I don't think Jean has been at it either. <laughs> it's all good. Ooh. That was my bash quad. Yeah, dude. That was cool. That was chunky. <laughs> that was chunky. Okay, so what do we have for lap number two? So lap number two, we're going to uh, drop into hind grinders. It's another rocky kind of slab trail. Sounds good. I really enjoy the one we just did, so I look forward to this one. You like that one? You're going to like this one. Perfect. Okay, lap number two. Forest is so nice. Oh wow. Woo. Yeah, dude. All right, this is where the trail kind of actually starts. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. What is this? Oh dear. Oh nice. I absolutely love riding blind on the trails. Haha. <laughs> That's sick! Little what? Oh, okay. Yeah! That was cool! Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah, buddy! That was cool. Yeah, that's kind of the first bit. There's something special about riding a trail for the first time and, you know, especially when you follow someone that knows it, it's sick.
Ah, the view. I'm really enjoying the island. Good man. Could see myself here at some point. I'd love to see that. Yeah, dude. See? Oh, yeah. That was good. Wow, didn't see the tree. Oh wow. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. That was really cool. That was a good one, eh? Yeah. Oh, yeah I think I liked it even better than the first one. Really? Yeah. More accessible. Maybe not as gnarly. Yeah. But a bit more flow. Some more drops, some more jumps. More more playful. Yeah, it's definitely um, got some good flow to it. Yeah, that was, that was great. On to Nighty's Jank. It's like a pump truck. Hey, how are you? Hey. It's got a lot of flow actually. Okay. Oh. Yeah, dude. Did you get it, buddy? Oh, my first skinny in a long time. I really don't like this. Yeah, sorry on the. On the rock slab, I took a different line and I ended up on the left. Oh, okay. But then I was able to cut back and it's cool. It gets a lot of flow. Yeah. You can really pump and if you pick up the, the right compression, you can actually get the bike to accelerate and carry good speed for what's after and you don't have to pedal much. Yeah. Ah, that's cool.
Oh, it's sick with a clip. Super fun. Wow. It's a really beautiful place. Thanks a lot for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification. That way you know when my next video is posted. And by the way, right now I'm at home. So what do you want to see next? Whistler, Vancouver, Squamish, Pemberton, you let me know, I'll do my best to make it happen. I want to see what you have in your mind in the comments below. And as always, to support the channel, check out those links. You can also save some money. I have some super cool codes. See you next week.